After a couple of failed attempts, lawmaker Jim Jordan on Thursday vowed to continue his bid for Speaker of the U.S. House of Representatives. That's after his fellow Republicans threw out a backup to allow the leaderless chamber to resume working. Jordan, a hardline conservative, lost two votes for Speaker this week, emerged from an hours-long closed-door meeting with Republicans to say he would press ahead with a third vote. Sorry, I'll ask you this. According to lawmakers in the room, Jordan had earlier said he would pause his bid and back the plan to empower the current acting speaker, Patrick McHenry, to hold the post until January. But many Republicans objected to that proposal. Here's Congressman Troy Nels. I like the idea of staying in there, take the jackets off, off, pack some lunches, get some bag lunches in here. We don't leave there until we get a speaker. A speaker has not been elected. And so it's back to voting, as the House remains without a leader after the ousting of Kevin McCarthy two weeks ago. It remains unclear how Congress, without a leader in the House, would push through billions of dollars in funding for Ukraine and Israel at President Joe Biden's expected request. Funding for U.S. government operations is also due to expire in less than a month, unless Congress acts.